Hello again, we have got Adrian Erdidi. Yes, Yanni, how are you? Good, thanks. Mr. Espanol. Espanol, si, sí, soy espanol. Oh, <laughs> you are of Spanish background. That's right, but yes. But you're also a bit Hungarian. I've got a mix of Hungarian in there as well. Very interesting. Is, yes, quite exotic. But tonight we're doing a bit of Espanol. Yes, I thought Now, I'd... please, please, this is going to sound like an SBS production. What is the dish called? Gambas al ajil. Ooh. Which is garlic prawns. This is probably the easiest and the quickest dish you could ever make. Okay. Just prawns, garlic, lots of it, and parsley. Uh, salt and pepper to, um, for seasoning, and oil. And of course you need the bread. The bread, bread is the most important part because that's what like you're going to be. <laughs> and it's got to be crusty too, it's a hard one. It's crusty, we're crusty. Now I have noticed that yes. we have got something very, very special in common. We're both into extra virgin olive oil. <laughs> that should be about enough. Wow, that's quite a bit of oil. So that's about a third of a bottle, but that is okay. a big pan. You can have um, dry, you, if you want to call it dry, yeah. or wet uh -huh. garlic prawns. So yeah. that would, I, I prefer to have it as wet. So yeah. when you serve it, it's in oil. Yeah. So you can soak it up with the bread, mm. which is beautiful. That's, that's why us Mediterraneans have so much extra flavor. <laughs> <laughs> While that's heating, yeah. well, um, what Look, are we going to do? We can do? just cut bread. On an angle or...? or Let's do it on an angle. It makes it easier to dip into the oil. Oh, this is crusty. What sort of bread is this? It's just a French stick. Okay. It needs to be crusty. It'll soak the oil a lot mm. better. So while that's still heating, we've got to make sure that the oil does not burn. Okay. So we can always put a little tiny bit of garlic in there just to check if it sizzles. Oh. It looks like it, it's... Oh. Yeah, that sounds good to me. This is a lot of garlic. So what we're doing is we are flavouring the oil. That's right. Because I remember the first time I ever saw someone do this was literally about 20 years ago and it was yeah. done by an Italian guy yeah. who was working in an Italian restaurant. Important thing is don't let the, the garlic cook for too long. So we need to then put the prawns in in about in a few seconds. Okay. Throw them in. Wow. Now what sort Spread of prawns are they? They are green tug, uh, green king tongue. prawns, I think they king are. Prawns. Well, okay. Yeah. And You've left the tail on. I've left the tails on. It's, it just looks better. It presents yeah. a lot better. And then you I can think. grab them by the end. And then that's it. That's yeah. exactly right. And they're finger right. licking good. <laughs> yeah. You know? So they'll take oh, maybe three to four minutes to cook. Okay, cool. Um, that's all we really need. We don't want to overcook them. So you can easy. see the garlic is actually browning as well. Wow. Hey, that's smelling incredible. How good does it smell? Yeah. Just amazing. Now, in the meantime, yes. We're going to talk shop. Okay. We're going to talk about you. Okay. You're okay. the shop. Yes. Okay. My favourite topic. I come from an advertising background. Uh -huh. so I've been working advertising for a very long time. Yep. Always been interested in media. So, like yeah. you, yep. heading towards now, the... How did we meet? We met at Fashion Week. We did meet at a Fashion yes. Week event. Yes. So, um, that was for lunch. Yes. It was so funny because because I said to you... No, you, you said to me, what, what do I do? And I said, I'm a TV presenter. And then I said to you, what do you do? And, and you were the same thing. doing the same thing. <laughs> we realised that we had TV in common. We also that's had some right. friends in common. That's we right. Both we both know did. Peter Everett. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, right. Yeah, he's a nice guy. He's a very nice Lovely guy. guy. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes. From very good for years. And yeah, years. me too. Yeah, yeah. Me too. Yeah, he's a great guy. Chief. They've curled up. Do you want me to turn the heat down a bit? You could turn it down. Yeah, oh, just, yeah just a little bit. You don't. Just yeah. a little bit. Okay. Now you recently bought a fabulous apartment that you're renovating. I did. I'm in the middle of renovations, and that's almost finished. I just can't wait. It feels like it's been going forever. Deal, but, um, isn't it? Pretty okay. much gutted. Um, yeah. It's only a few years old, but yeah. I wanted it but you my way. It your way, yeah. So re I've redone it all, mm -hmm. and okay. so it'll be and nice. And you said you have an interest in getting involved with radio. Yes. So yeah. um, shortly I'll be um, doing some volunteer work at a radio station, oh, and also cool. studying radio presentation. Wow! So really excited about mm. that. I've been loved radio since I was little. Mm. So um, well, you've got a good voice. Uh, well, I hope so. Yeah, <laughs> I'd hope so. I think that's quite important. Put a bit of seasoning on it. Some okay, sure. Salt and pepper. Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, so not too much pepper, because you don't want to take away too much from the garlic. Yeah, that's plenty. Plenty of pepper. Okay, cool. And some salt. salt. Stir it a little bit more. Yep. And then that's it. Do you have dinner parties? Not yet, seeing my oh, house is still oh, okay. currently under oh, renovation. Okay. You will, you will. But I will have lots of dinner yeah, okay, parties. Okay, cool, alright. All uh, right. I have a pretty cool kitchen. If you can pour it in, 
into this Without clay. Without splashing too much. Um, into this clay pot, Into I the guess. clay pot. Uh, would you re recycle the um, the oil? Would you kind Had of like, you know, obviously we're not going to drink you this can. oil. I, yeah, um, I have recycled the oil before for um, for other cooking. For stir fries. Yeah. Um, because but I have to I'm, say. I mean, that's a real ethnic thing, isn't it? It you is, know, like, yeah. Because this oil is so oh. flavoursome now. I'm just getting all these memories of my childhood because there I remember my mother used to do this kind of stuff, putting yeah. you know, these fresh um, herbs on. In Spain, um, I lived in Spain for a little while um, mm -hmm. a few years ago. They would normally make, make it in these pots, the ceramic, the terracotta pots. And they bake it in there. Yeah, that's right. So, yeah. I mean, not everyone has these. That's why we've used a pan. Now, tell me, do you speak Spanish? I do. Ah. Si. Do you speak Hungarian? Hablo... Oh, hang on. How about with the Hungarian side? What's the... Nunca hablo uh, Hungario. Solo, solo hablo uh, hablar español. Okay, what language is that? What's the Hungarian language? Yeah, Hungarian. Oh, there is a Hungarian <laughs> language. <laughs> All right, okay. I'm not that cultural. Get with it, Yanni. No, <laughs> I'm not. Too busy doing the show. I'm too... I'm too caught up with being Greek, that's my problem. Yeah. <laughs> so make sure you take a nice big prawn and, and all you need to do is squeeze the tail off mm -hmm. really quite easily. Oh, this is it in there. soaking in it. And oh, 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 I've oh, lost oh. it. Ouch. Well, try and grab some garlic as well. That's if you love oh, garlic, yeah. but I'm a big fan of garlic. Mm. Let's take a giant piece. It's not strong, so it won't overpower the flavour. Okay, the, I've got it off. Mm, 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 mm. And oh. See, but I love, really hot. you know what, one thing Anglos don't get that ethnic people get mm. is eating out of the same plate. Yeah. You know, it's such a big deal. And sharing. Okay, cool. And sharing. Okay, let me try. Mm. They're great, aren't they? Mm. The amazing. garlic is also quite crispy, which is beautiful. Mm. Even though it's in oil and it's wet, it's still really quite crispy. Mm. That's really good. Mm. Okay. You can also toast the bread too if you wanted to, to make it a bit oh. crispier. But I like it. I like it like this because it just soaks up the oil. Wow! Put lots of garlic on it too. It's great. Mmm. I could mm. do this. We could eat this all night. This is mm. great. Mm. <laughs> That's just amazing. Mm. Mm. You need a cold drink, so a glass of white wine or some sort of champagne. Mm. Beautiful. Mm. You can share these with friends. It's great. Mm. This is what I love. Mm. Good food that is real living. It you could nice. serve it as a, as a um, entree if you wanted to. Mm. We're very nice. simple. We're very nice. We, we are. Both of us. You're not a moaner and groaner, are you? Because <laughs> I like to moan and groan. And, mm. <laughs> no. All right. All right, well, Adrian Erdetti. That's right, yes. Thank you very much for coming in. Thank you, Yanni, for having me. Pleasure, giving us a bit of Espanol. Espanol, sí. Special treatment. Gracias. Here on Yanni's City Life. <laughs> Thanks for coming in. We'll see you soon. Thank you, Yanni. Thank Thanks. you. Bye. Bye. Thank you.